most men are attracted to misogynistic and extreme ideas because of the rise of what they see on social media. And they've surveyed uh, just over 2,000 men in the US. Now this is undoubtedly down to the rise of people like Andrew Tate, uh, Jordan Peterson. Men feel like they're being suppressed and these voices are talking to a generation of guys that feel like there's no one listening to them and that there's no one talking what they are thinking. So you can understand why they're attracted to that type of ideology if there's, you know, the hope isn't there effectively. Men from the age of 18 to 23 uh, have the lowest levels of optimism about their futures and the least amount of social support to deal with that. So it's like a forgotten generation, really. The report has suggested, and also I kind of agree on as well, is that this idea of promoting healthy masculinity needs to be pushed big time.